We had a major storm last night and the water overwhelmed the culvert. However, it's still intact. It's overbuilt, like some YouTubers mentioned. However, it has many large logs in it. The water went completely over the yard and completely over the road and in the ditch. The concrete and riprap held there as well as the spillover. However, the driveway did not. So I'm pretty happy with it, although I've got to move the stone back. A lot of it went down the road. And a tree fell. The exit looks fine. So anyway, it looks like I'll be cleaning up a little bit here. Must have been a sight to see, but I wasn't here because it was way too windy last night and raining. Anyway, it's a rare event, so hopefully it won't happen too much. Now I can decide what to do to try to keep that in place. Originally, I was going to take the concrete and go farther to the road, but... Um, I didn't want to get too close to the road. This is crazy. I didn't think there were any logs upstream that were quite that big, but evidently I didn't get them all. I thought a little bit more about this repair and I noticed that the riprap and a little bit of concrete stayed in place here on the washover. So I believe where I lacked was not having any geofabric underneath this and it just washed away down below. So I think what I want to do is maybe put a little bit of concrete and some large rocks and stone and limestone in there and just fill that in and then put geofabric on top of it so that it will uh, compress on top of that and if anything ever washes away I just add a little bit of stone on top the 53's right here they set up just like concrete 
it didn't even wash out hardly just the top layer but that's because everyone drives over the top of this and no one was driving over here so it really wasn't compressed so that's my plan for now maybe the next big washout I won't have to deal with this big loss of stone and and soils and everything here I'll be able to have a minor repair water went all the way up to the edge of that tall grass there that's how tall the water went all the way over the road all the way over the drive five inches I believe it was within an hour if anybody has any ideas what they might do feel free to comment I don't believe I need a full slab however just the most cost efficient would be just to cover it with some concrete and rock and geofabric cloth all right